Hey yo, what is up guys? Welcome to another video. I hope that you are all having an amazing day. So for today's video, I will be teaching you how to reset your PLDT's Wi-Fi password, enable your admin settings, and enable your LAN ports. So without any further ado, let's get on with the video. Okay, so what we're going to do first is we are going to reset our router by pressing the reset button on the back using a pin, and then press it for at least 30 seconds to make sure that it's fully reset and then after that we are going to open our favorite browser on our computer and we are going to enter this right here on the address bar and click enter like so and then after that we are going to enter our credentials both the admin and our password which is one two three four and then after that what we're going to do is we are going to fill all of these up right here so this right here is the page where we will set up the account for our router but like this is not yet the admin account that we're going to access and then this is also the page where we can set up our wi-fi's name and password into whatever we want it to be so we have the regular wi-fi and we also have the 5g wi-fi right there so just follow the instructions written on the screen and then we're good to go and don't forget to mix upper and lower case letters numbers and symbols for your password to work and then we click apply and then as you can see right there it says access successful click back right there and then what we're going to do next is we're going to change this username right here into administrator by typing in slash fh on the address bar and then pressing enter and as you can see right now it is now administrator instead of username and then what we're going to do next is we are going to log in the credentials written on the description which would lead us to the super admin account right there all you have to do is just copy and paste it from the description box and then if the passwords don't work just try another one it's like yeah like so as you can see just copy and paste it like so try the different passwords that you can find until you get it right and then there it goes we're in and then once we are finally in what we're going to do next is we are going to go to debug switch right here and then enable web admin switch right there and then press apply like so and then after that we can finally log out or like you could follow what I'm going to do right here which is type in this all over on the address bar which will lead us back to the login section right here and then what we're going to do next is we're going to log in another account which is the final account which is located right here or like you know you can like try other passwords and usernames which are also located on the description box if you need them all you have to do is just copy and paste it and it will bring you to this page right here which will then again prompt you to enter a new username and password and then in the password right here we are going to enter the password that we used to enter this account like so and then over here we're going to type in the new password that we want that we can easily remember so that we won't have any problems in the future so as you can see right there it says access successful go back and then we can finally log in using admin pldt and then the password that we just entered like so and then there it goes we are finally in and then we have full control over our router we can do whatever we want we can like um enable our lan ports if you want we can change our username and password again we can yeah basically whatever you want to do with a router you can do it right now because like you have full admin access so uh yeah thank you for watching i'll see you guys in the next video if you have any questions uh comment down below and we'll try to fix them so yeah good luck